Hello and welcome back dear students of standard 9th. Once again I welcome all of you to my English YouTube channel. Friends, today we are going to talk an interesting question of English question paper and the question is write an appreciation. Friends, previously the same question it carried for 10 marks but right present the same question it is for 5 marks. Now, on what basis we have to write an appreciation at very first we are going to understand the points. Therefore, without any delay, let us start the appreciation of English poem by using the five different points. Friends, the points are title of a poem which carries half mark, poet of a poem once again it carries half mark, Rhyme scheme of a poem, it comes for one mark, figures of speech, it stands for one mark and theme or central idea of a poem, it carries two marks. Now, through the example, let us try to understand how to write an appreciation by using, by collecting all that five points together. Some points we have mentioned here in short manner, yes, let us go through that point at very first. As it is, title of the poem is Life. Poet of the poem is Charlotte, yes, Charlotte Bronte. Rhyme scheme of a poem that is A, B, C, B, D, E, D, E, and continuously so on. Next is figures of speech that is personification, metaphor, and etc. And central idea as well as theme of a poem that is. We must have courage to overcome any problem in our life. Friends, yes, on that basis of five points, now try to collect the information together and we have to write appreciation of a poem in paragraph format. Once again, let me remind you people, we have to write appreciation of a poem in paragraph format. Therefore, let us collect all these points together to write appreciation. The first point that is title, title of a poem is life, put the single inverted or you can highlight the title of a poem by using a pencil. Next, a beautiful poem regarding to life, it is written by Charlotte Bronte. Next and the third point that is rhyme scheme, yes now we know it, A, B, C, B as well as once again A, B, C, B as well as D, E, D, E and continuously so on the particular rhyme scheme it is used in this poem by the poet. Next is the figures of speech. Now number of figures of, figures of speech they are in this poem but mainly the figures of speech which are focused by the poet we have to mention and they are personification and metaphor. And one more the last point that is theme or central idea that theme and central idea of a poem, we must have courage to overcome any problem in our life. Once again, we must keep positive attitude or we must have a proper courageous mind to overcome all the problems that we people face in our life. Friends, once again let me remind you people, while writing an appreciation in paragraph format, if we highlight the key points, the key points such as title, poet, rhyme scheme, figures of speech and theme and central idea. If we highlight these key points by using a pencil in our answer sheet, surely that will look more beautiful and that will attract the attention of the reader, of the examiner as well as of the moderator. I hope through this video you might have understood how to write an appreciation and important question of English uh, question paper yes in a paragraph format by using all these points thank you and have a nice day